Hi guys, it's Alex here, and we are definitely going to have a storm system that's going to hit Illinois this weekend with thunderstorms, possibly with snow and rain. It's going to be um, quite a change. So, um, regard the background noise. Um, here we go. Pines in the lower 40s. West winds around 5 miles an hour becoming southwest 10 to 15 miles an hour in the afternoon. Wednesday night, mostly clear. Lows in the mid-30s. South winds 10 to 15 miles an hour with gusts up to 25 miles an hour. Thursday, sunny. Not as cool with highs in the upper 50s. South winds 15 to 20 miles an hour with gusts up to 30 miles an hour. Thursday night, partly cloudy. Not as cool with lows in the mid-40s. Friday, partly sunny. Highs around 60. Friday night, mostly cloudy. A chance of rain until midnight, then rain likely after midnight. Lows in the upper 40s. Chance of rain 70%. Saturday, rain likely. Highs in the mid 50s. Temperature falling into the upper 40s in the afternoon. Chance of rain 70%. Saturday night, mostly cloudy with a chance of rain. A chance of snow after midnight. Much cooler with lows around 30. Chance of precipitation 50%. Sunday and Sunday night, partly cloudy. Highs in the upper 30s. Lows in the mid 20s. Monday, mostly sunny. Highs in the mid 40s. Again, the forecast for Jacksonville and surrounding areas of West Central Illinois for the rest of today, cloudy. Near steady temperature in the upper 30s. Northwest winds around 15 miles an hour with gusts up to 30 miles an hour. At 3 p.m. at the Jacksonville airport, skies were cloudy. Visibility was 4 miles. The temperature was 37 degrees. The dew point and relative humidity were not available. The wind was northwest at 15 miles an hour, producing a wind chill of 27. The pressure was 30.12 inches and rising. Looking around western and central Illinois, temperatures were around 40 degrees. It was cloudy at Quincy, Alton, and Pittsfield. At Mount Sterling, Peoria, and Galesburg, it was cloudy. At Springfield, rain and fog were reported. And once again at 3 p.m. at the Jacksonville Airport, under cloudy skies, the temperature was 37 degrees, and the wind chill was 27. Looking elsewhere around the Midwest at 3 p.m., Chicago was cloudy and 41. Indianapolis was cloudy and 43. St. Louis was cloudy and 42. Kansas City was mostly sunny and 47. Des Moines was cloudy and 36. Milwaukee was cloudy and 40. And now a discussion of hazardous weather conditions for the following counties in Illinois, Cass, Morgan, and Scott. This hazardous weather outlook is for Central Illinois, East Central Illinois, Southeast Illinois, and West Central Illinois. For tonight, no hazardous weather is expected at this time. For Wednesday through Monday, a strong storm system will impact Central Illinois this weekend. While it is still too early to pinpoint specific hazards, the potential exists for thunderstorms, particularly along and east of Interstate 55. As the system departs, rain may change to a period of wet snow Saturday night into Sunday, with areas along and west of Interstate 55 favored for snow. Stay tuned to later forecasts for additional details. Spotter information statement, spotter activation is not anticipated tonight. The time is currently 3.52 p.m. Central Standard Time. All right, there you go, guys. There you have it. The first winter storm of 2023.